What up, Melvin7 here, North American Tour and South American Tour SBCs are out. I love these ones, they're very creative, um, the kind of advanced SBCs, not just the, the League of Nation hybrids that we have been having. Anyway, uh, yeah, this one, very, very easy. The, like the last ones, uh, the playing abroad and the foreign players, I think, uh, one of them is easy and one of them is a bit more difficult. This one's the easy one. You can use bronze players. All you need, two Canadian players. So I've got this guy uh, called Trafford and then we've got uh, Stampoulos uh, in goal. And what I've done, I've got their league and basically just got players in my club that were in that league. So we've got the, um, the Danish league, I think, is that? Or is that the Swedish league? Probably the Swedish league because there's a lot of Swedish players there. And um, then with this guy, I think he's from the Polish League, so I've got a bunch of Polish League players. And then, because of the chemistry, I've got this random left back from the uh, Norwegian League, is that? Anyhow, uh, yeah, you only need 90 chemistry. If you were to follow it exactly how I've done it, you would uh, need loyalty. That's the same with a lot of the squads. Uh, I'm just using players in my club. This is not the cheapest way to do it or anything. This is just how I have personally done this. Uh, the next one we've got is the Mexican one. This one's very, very easy. I've got the four Mexican players, all from the Mexican League, in the centre-back positions and the goalkeeper. And then the rest of it, I've got some championship midfielders, uh, to all English to kind of section it off and get all the chemistry. And then I've got uh, an English cam, and then because you need four nationalities, I've got uh, random... Uh, nations in the championship so we've got Austria and Wales there again you can use all bronze players but I'm just using players in my club so we'll submit that and we move o over to the United States one now this one uh, is a little bit similar I think you need five United States players so of course I've went with the the three um, at the back and then MLS players the left back and the center mid and the rest of it because one of my center backs was from the uh, Alka Super League I've built players around that. I think that one's the Danish league. Uh, so we've got three players there. And then I've sectioned off the strikers and just went with uh, La Liga 1, 2, 3, I think. Yeah, for the next three. And uh, yeah, pretty simple. 7.5k pack there. I'm trying to do these quickly, of course. Um, there'll be way, way, way better solutions. And I think I've already used this guy. I know who it is, though. So uh, I can just put the La Liga center attack in mid there. I'm not really asked who. There you go. Right. So this one, you need one Costa Rican player, two, uh, one Honduras or Panama players. So I've got this Honduras player from the Bundesliga 2. So I've got some Bundesliga 2 players, all German, to get the chemistry around him. And then we've got a Honduran in uh, La Liga 1, 2, 3. So again, I've got some Spanish La Liga 1, 2, 3 players. Very, very simple. Six maximum uh, in the league that you're allowed. And uh, yeah, it was very, very easy to just do a two league hybrid there. So that one is done. We get a 15k pack and a kit there. I'm going to store that in the club because people will probably back out if I use that on foot champs, which is a bit disappointing. But anyway, uh, the South American tour. Now, this one is the harder of the, the two. First one, you've got 80 rated squad. You need seven rare players, four Argentinian players. Four maximum from the same league and four nationalities. So the Argentinian players, I've got four from the Liga Santander. Uh, yes, you'll notice that one of them is a centre mid purely because he's in my club, but you could use Mustachio. Uh, he's a, a centre mid that's quite high rated that would boost your rating up because you do need it to be 80. Then we've got um, another Argentinian in the Premier League and I've built kind of a little bit of a hybrid. We've got Premier League players in there with uh, Nkuru. Uh, sorry, Dekure. I knew what the fuck I meant. Anyway, uh, Deli Ali and Welbeck. And then I've kind of went to the championship because they've got English players, of course. And then uh, we've got this bright and right mid to link with our championship striker, Knockout. And uh, yeah, we've just got Conor Plyanka to fill up the rating and also the chemistry. Now, this one would definitely require loyalty. There's going to be a hundred better ways to do it. But um, I'm just trying to use things in my club. I'm trying to get these videos out as, pos uh, as quick as possible because obviously a lot of people do the SBCs and I'm going to have to buy Conor Plyanka, aren't I? Because I'm pretty sure I use him in this one as well. Um, I think, I'm hoping I do. Yeah, yeah, I do. Um, I mean, I'm not really arsed. He'd be cheaper than that, but yeah, I mean, he's 83 rated and he's very, very cheap anyway. You can probably get him for 1.5 under that. Anyway. This one, you only need seven Brazilian players, but I, I literally, I had to think, there's ways you could probably do it, but it would require loyalty regardless, unless you've got a full Brazilian team, because you need, well, 
One player has to be not from Brazil, which is what I've done, Conor Playanka. But you need nine rare players and you also need ten different leagues. So you probably are going to need loyalty regardless on this because, yeah, I mean, I just can't figure a way of getting 95 chemistry without loyalty. There might be a way, but I, I don't know. So I've just got uh, ten Brazilian players from different leagues. We've got um, La Liga, we've got Calcio A, we've got the Greek League, the Eredivisie, the Russian League. Bundesliga, the Ukrainian League, the Portuguese League, the Korean League, uh, Liga Un, and then of course uh, the other player uh, from a different nationality who links with uh, Gustavo there, a soft link to give the chemistry. Got Conor Plyanka, who is Ukrainian. So get a 35k pack for that one, and we move over, and 1k coins, I suppose. We move over to the Colombian one. Personally, the Argentinian one was the hardest uh, for me. It probably took me as long to complete that as the other three. These ones are very, very easy. We've got, um, you need three Colombian players, rare players, maximum six, and then you can read the rest of the constraints. But uh, I'll spin a net, and then I've sectioned it off with three English Premier League uh, centre-backs to get the chemistry. Then we've got Falcao, and we've also got Ibarbo, his Calcio A version, so they get a soft link. Then I've got two Monaco players, one of which is silver. You do need this to be 79 rated, um, so... You could use a different player here. You could probably use a Brazilian um, League One player, to be honest. But then we've got um, Fabinho there to link with uh, Falco, of course. Then a random Syria right mid just to get a soft link with uh, Abobo. If there is someone from the same club, uh, Caligri, then you could use that. And then on the other side, we've got a perfect link for uh, Hesse and the upgraded Vieira, who's very, very cheap. So, yeah, this one was very easy to do, to be fair. Uh, three Colombians, of course, is what you needed there. And the last one is a bit similar to the last one, to be honest. We've got Uruguay. You need three Uruguay players and um, four different leagues, pretty much. And a maximum players from the same nation is five. That's pretty much irrelevant because I, I don't really see you using that too much. 79 overall team, so we've got Muslera in net, and then two Galatasaray players to give him strong links. We've got uh, another Ukrainian striker here from the Mexican League, and then another Ukrainian to get a very strong link. You don't even need to do what I've done and get like Mexican players here, you could probably just get a different league, because they get full chem now, uh, the two Uruguayans up there. But... I've just done it this way, so uh, yeah, we've got La Liga on the left uh, for those three, and then we've got Seamus Coleman here. Again, this one would require loyalty. There might be a way to do it without loyalty, but um, I just can't see it at the minute. So yeah, Seamus Coleman just to fill up the chemistry and everything and the rating. Anyway, yes, I didn't explain that as best as I probably should do in these videos, but as I say, time constraints also just trying to get everything out when I can and also trying to just balance everything. Yeah, I mean, hopefully you understand. I know those solutions weren't the greatest. Some of them were decent, some of them weren't, and they, they aren't the cheapest, of course, which is probably what you want, but they weren't that expensive, to be honest, unless the players really inflate in value, which might happen, but that's the market. That's not my fault. Um, Anyhow, we don't really get anything in there. Actually, we get a Willem 2 centre-back who might actually go for something, but I'm just going to discard uh, those move over. We'll obviously do the worst packs first. Um, so, yeah, yeah, what do we have? We've got two silver packs, so we'll open those, get them out of the way. No one cares about them. We've got a 50k pack overall for doing this, though, which is very, very nice. Hopefully, we can get something good in that. The servers seem to be a bit laggy today. Probably shouldn't have discarded that. He might go for a bit um, just because of these new SBCs. Anyway, we've got another uh, silver pack here. I'm just storing everything in my club. Like No one really cares to watch uh, silver players. There looks like there could be a couple of high-value silvers in that pack. But we'll just move on. Right. So now we can open them in order pretty much, I think. A 7.5k pack to start things off. No flare, of course. I prefer the big flare in the 50k pack, to be fair. I mean, I don't really care which pack it is, but that's the most likely for it to be, of course. Uh, then we've got a 15k pack. You do get a lot of good packs for this, to be fair. Uh, a wide variety. I think you get all the special packs, bar 100k, to be honest. I think there's both versions of the 25. You've got the 15, the 7.5, the 50, the 35k, the 45k pack as well. I'm probably discarding valuable cards there. I, I should just be sending them to the transfer list, really. But, um, right. We've got the 25k pack. 
yeah, we'll open that next. I want to make sure I open the 50k pack last, just to get steadily better in the packs. Oh, that's the theory anyway. Nothing there, no 80 rated players. Um, that's very, very disappointing. Right, move on to the next one. We'll open the next 25k pack. Yeah, you pretty much get every special pack bar a 100k pack, which isn't too bad. Um, center back, Jardel, he might actually go for a bit. High rated Brazilian player in a, not an obscure league, but you know, a league which doesn't have many high rated players. Um, so yeah, I'll definitely send that up. I'll send those up. Actually, I might as well send that Brazilian up. He'll go for an inflated price. And move on to the, you know what, this one, I know it's 45k, but they, they're shite for me. They're always shite. Told you. I just I just knew it. I think I've had one good card out of these, and I've opened so many of them. Um, right, we'll send all them to the transfer list, discard those. Then we move over to the 35k pack, which have actually been kind to me this FIFA. Is it going to be kind again? Doesn't look like it. No, it has not been kind. We haven't even had an 84 rated player, for fuck's sake. We've got the 50k pack, so hope isn't lost yet. But I'm not really expecting anything in the 50k pack, to be fair. But we'll, we'll see. We'll see. All right, please. This is what you do SBCs for, really. The big packs. The good packs. Come on. Fucking, it's going to be shite, isn't it? Oh, my God. Not even an 84 rated player, man. An 82 rated player, oh fuck off man, well these were a waste of fucking time for me, um, hopefully they were a lot better to you, but um, yeah I probably broke about even if I was to actually buy that, uh, so fairly pointless for me, but I mean yeah, they, they're probably going to be a lot better for you, so hopefully you have enjoyed, subscribe if you haven't already, like the video and yeah, peace.